Yo, what is going on everyone? Guiding Light here. And in this video, I'm going to show you guys how you can unlock Luna. Now, this is the brand new Descendant, which was just added here in today's update. And the fastest way to get her is by doing Void Fusion Reactors. Now, you're going to have to do a few different ones. We're going to start out with this first part here. And anytime you see this, you want to go over to the hard version to make this faster. The first thing you'll want to do is go over to Echo Swamp and farm out this key or this amorphous material. Now it's very similar as to how you're going to unlock the other descendants in the game. But keep in mind that you will have to get specific drops. It may take a little bit of time, but most of them have pretty high drop rates. So I could see this being done pretty quickly, at least for Luna. Now, in order to unlock Luna at some point or another, you will need Sharon, at least in order to do it the fastest way. If you don't have Sharon, then you will have to go and do the boss fights instead in order to get the drops. And it does take a little bit longer. Now, in order to get the amorphous material, you'll have to come here to these missions and do them on stealth. That's why you'll, you will need Sharon so that you can go invisible. Now, you can still unlock her without Sharon, but it will take a little bit longer just because you have to go into those void intercept battles. Now, these missions the, with Sharon, keep in mind the amorphous material that you're after. It's not guaranteed. It has a pretty high drop rate, and these, uh, these missions only take about a minute to reset. So you just have to run it again and again until eventually you see the amorphous material pop up. Now they have added new amorphous material with the AA pattern at the end. So that's the one you're actually going to be looking for. Once you get it, you're going to go over to the void fragment and you just have to start it up. It's literally right here and it'll tell you if you have the key or the right amorphous material or not before starting the mission. Now, after you have this piece, you're going to do the same process for pretty much all the other parts. This time though, you're going to go to a different void fusion reactor. If you don't have the option or if you don't have Sharon, just do the boss fight instead. But this time you're going to want to go over to White Knight Gulch and get this part here. Now this time you don't actually have to do it on stealth, but you may as well if you have Sharon. Once you have that part, just take it over to this Void Fusion Reactor instead. Now onto the third part. It's literally the exact same process with another Void Fusion Reactor. This time around though, we're going to go and get the pattern number 71 AA. It's the same thing that you have to go in with stealth with Sharon. You're going to get the amorphous material and then just bring it over to the void fragment which is located on the exact same place right here and until you get the part you're going to have to run that a few times until eventually you get that last drop now for the code it's the, again the same process but this time you don't have to do it on stealth if you don't want to head over to the desert get the amorphous material and then bring it to the void fragment which is located right next to it so overall this is actually one of the easiest descendants to unlock Especially if you already have Sharon, you could probably get this done in a few hours. But keep in mind, guys, like always, some of these drops are going to take more time than not. But they have a really, really high drop rate, and these missions don't take very long at all. So hopefully this helps you guys out. I'm probably just going to purchase Luna just because I want to be able to make videos and guides to showcase whether or not she's really worth it for you guys before you really spend the time grinding her out. So stay tuned to the channel if you want to see some gameplay, and I will catch you in the next one. Peace.